Looking at the complexity of situation resulting from the emergence of so many Englishes around the world, the world English scholars have tried to predict a scenario vis-à-vis -vis future of English. MacArthur had introduced the term English language complex, which was later on used by other scholars as well. The English language complex comprises almost all subtypes of English. For example, one uh, type of English which is included in this complex is the Metropolitan Standards, which refers to the formal models provided by TV and radio networks. For example, uh, many people look towards BBC as a model for their own English. Similarly, CNN is also considered a model for American English by many people. Then we have colonial standards, um, which are the uh, standards or the English uh, which is used in the ex-territorial um, regions, for example, Australia, New Zealand, Canada, South Africa, Zimbabwe, etc. And then we have these regional dialects, which are the dialects which are used in different regions of these ex-territories of um, the British crown. Then we have something we call social dialect. A social dialect, of course, is used in all varieties of English and it refers to the differences which are based on the social class and ethnicity of the users of English. And then we have Pigeon and Creole English, which are the um, languages which emerge as a result of contact between two or more languages, one of them being English. Uh, then, of course, we have English as a second language, uh, which is the English used in the countries which were formerly British colonies. And then English as a foreign language is also included in this complex, which refers to the English um, variety used in expanding circle or um, countries like China, Japan, Korea, etc., uh, in this complex, we now also have something called immigrant Englishes, with a large number of people from all around the world immigrating to English-speaking countries. The emergence of this variety is inevitable. Um, and of course, this is also a, a variety which um, results as a result of contact between these immigrant people and the native English speakers. And then we also have these hybrid Englishes, uh, the Englishes which are a result of code mixing and hybrid Englishes can also be found within different varieties of English. So in English language complex, um, all these varieties are captured. Uh, when we have so many different varieties of English being used in the world at the same time, uh, something is likely to happen uh, to the English language itself. So what will happen? The, the diversity in the use of English is again inevitable because uh, there are so many different people using different types of Englishes in different parts of the world. The English language is bound to become more and more di diversified. One factor of course is the immigrant diversity. When so many people uh, have come to live in uh, English-speaking countries, uh, the, the language is bound to change. It is said that only in London there are 300 different languages spoken. And of course, the speakers of these languages interact with English-speaking people. Um, there's also a very important uh, social factor, the, the emergence of a social relationship between uh, people who belong to uh, countries or who belong to um, uh, nations which do not share a language uh, and use English uh, only as the language of communication, but the English that they use or the English that they have learned is uh, English as a foreign language. For example, uh, if a Japanese uh, gentleman marries a Korean lady, uh, 
द मीन्स ऑफ कम्युनिकेशन बिटवीन दैम विल बी इंग्लिश एंड दैट ऑल्सो द वराइटी ऑफ इंग्लिश विच इज यूज एज अ फॉरन लैंग्वेज सो वी हैव थाउजेंड्स ऑफ चिल्ड्रन ऑल अराउंड द वर्ल्ड हु यूज दिस इन अ वे नॉन स्टैंडर्ड वराइटी ऑफ इंग्लिश एज अ मदर टंग सो दे ग्रो अप यूजिंग अ लैंग्वेज विच देयर पेरेंट्स यूज एंड विच इज नॉट द सेम एज अ स्टैंडर्ड इंग्लिश एज देयर मदर टंग so and again as a result of a consequence of this kind of uh, social relationship and contact etc the english language is bound to become more and more di- diversified and new varieties of course will emerge as a result of this interaction between um people who speak different kinds of englishes so what will happen what will happen to the english language will it diverge or will it converge to one standard uh, many scholars believe that there will be a lot of divergence especially in terms of um pronunciations there will be a lot of uh, diversification variation uh, taking place in terms of pronunciation but then there are other scholars who believe that um, even if there is divergence in terms of pronunciation there will be a lot of convergence um, in terms of the use of lexicon or vocabulary so what is feared is that this diversification or this divergence may uh, one day lead to complete unintelligibility among different varieties of english so because of the diversification taking place uh, as a result of um, the use of non standard englishes as mother tongue or um, varieties of english which are a result of contact between english and other languages uh, the un- un- unintelligibility among the varieties of english uh, which emerge as a result of these situations will increase so the 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 scholars are divided at the moment whether there will be more divergence or convergence um it is believed that in some aspects of the language there will be convergence and in the other there will be divergence